It's the Andy Griffith Show, Facts and Trivia, with your host, Bob Snap. Hi guys, welcome to the Andy Griffith Show, Facts and Trivia, appreciate you being here. Um, I'm kind of rushing through this because I've had no electricity today again, so I'm having to get this done quickly so I can get it out there um, today's video is on how a one episode of the Andy Griffith show sent George Lindsay who plays Cooper Kyle into a rage a very real rage let's take a look at it actor George Lindsay joined the Andy Griffith show cast on the show's fourth season as Goober Powell he's a cousin of course to Gomer Powell who played by Jim Neighbors Fans may recall Lindsay's lines on the show as first revolved around Goober's impressions of Cary Grant and actor Edward G. Robinson. What you may not know by many fans uh, was Lindsay's initial resentment towards the show. He detailed in his memoir, Goober in a Nutshell, the anger he felt after airing of a special episode. Griffith, um, Griffith had met nightclub performer Jim Neighbors in 1963 through a mutual friend. He had heard that Neighbors was performing and went to see what he had uh, heard would be a great show. Now Daniel Devise wrote in 2015's Andy and Don, The Making of a Friendship in Classic American TV show that the mutual friend escorted Andy to see Jim perform. I didn't want to go, he recalled, but the man got up and he was electrifying. Afterward, Andy caught up with Jim on the sidewalk outside, Devise said. I don't know what you do, but it's magic, whatever it is. If a part ever comes up for our show, I'll give you a call. The producers of the show originally had considered George Lindsay for the role of the dim-witted but gentle Gomer Pyle. But after Griffith to see Jim Neighbors' nightclub performance, however, he couldn't think of anyone else but Neighbors as Gomer Pyle. Griffith asked the show's producer Aaron Rubin to wait on hiring Lindsay for the role until he and show creator Sheldon Leonard met Neighbors. Reuben recalled, according to device, so in comes Jim Neighbors. He has a script he reads. We lacked in professionalism and experience he made up for in a certain naive charm that he had. Lindsay revealed he visited the show set a couple times, hoping Andy would notice and like him enough to keep him in mind. Griffith did and allowed Lindsay to read for the role of Gomer Pyle. Lindsay was granted the part only to have it taken away and given to Jim Neighbors. Neighbors debuted in his role as Gomer Pyle in the Griffith Show episode, Man in a Hurry. Lindsay watched Neighbors, that self-admitted am acting amateur, shine in the role meant for him. In his memoir, the goober actor described the range of emotions he experienced from, living in, from his living room couch. They brought Jim on as Gomer in an episode called Man in a Hurry, he wrote. It was a small part, but his performance in the entire episode really worked. When I was sitting in my living room after watching that first episode featuring Gomer, I jumped up from my chair in an absolute rage and kicked a tube out of the television set while screaming, that's my part, that's my part, that's my part. I just went completely nuts. I was so upset about not getting that role. This was the perfect part for me. Eventually, of course, he was hired as Gomer's cousin, Goober, but he refused to speak to neighbors for over a year after that. Now tell me. Do you think he had um, the right to be mad? I personally, I think he did. Uh, I mean, it, got, it was made up for later getting the part of Goober, but uh, I don't think he had the right to be mad at, at Jim Neighbors personally. That's what Jim's fault. I mean, I would have took the gig too. Anyway, um, hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, Please, if you have not yet, subscribe. I don't ask that very often on this channel because we're over 4,000 people, but uh, I'd really like to hold it up even more. And don't forget about classic sitcoms, facts, and trivia. Uh, today's is on uh, some things about I Love Lucy. Um, and if you don't mind, go back and look at yesterday's of classic sitcoms. I didn't hit, get very many hits, and I thought it was a really good one personally. Anyway, have a great day. God bless, and I'll be praying for you. Thank you.